Have you noticed that as everything around you seems to decline, one thing still grows? It is the power of your rulers. None of their plans and directives have solved your problems or made your life better. The only result has been their increased control over you at the cost of your freedom. Do you know why? You gave them the power. You gave them the power. I'm Wayne Garcia, first on Fox Tonight. The state of Oregon seems poised to turn up the heat on nurses who don't want to get vaccinated. Proposed rules by the Board of Nursing would make nurses get the vaccine or lose their nursing license. Lose their nursing license. Lose their nursing license. Fox 12's Bridget Chavez joins us live after speaking with a local nurse about these proposed rules. Bridget? Yeah, Arnhild Despino tells me she thinks the board is taking this too far and repercussions for those proposed rules would include fines or even losing your nursing license. The October 18th deadline for all healthcare workers in Oregon to be vaccinated or lose their job is looming. So I'm thinking about leaving nursing. Um, I haven't, you know, made a firm decision. Um, I'm a, a couple of years from retirement, uh, January of 2024, and this isn't exactly how I hoped I'd leave my nursing career. On top of this, the Oregon State Board of Nursing is considering new rules that would make it against state law. for a practicing nurse to not be vaccinated against COVID-19. In a memorandum, the Board of Nursing says, quote, The Department of Justice has determined that a health care worker licensed by an Oregon health care regulatory board must be in compliance or be found in violation of Oregon law. Well, I think it's a, a huge overreach um, for them to take that stance. Arnhild Despino has been a nurse for more than 30 years. She requested a religious exemption at Legacy Health, where she's worked for the past six years, but was denied. I will lose my job over this and I will do it willingly because that's, I mean, if, if, if this is upheld, which I believe is unconscionable, then I will be terminated. It'll be my first termination ever. But I'll, I'll, I'll do it. She says the state's vaccine mandate, coupled with these new proposed rules, will only make things worse. I believe we are creating a further shortage, and I don't know to what end. Penalties for the proposed rules could include fines of up to $2,900 or losing your nursing license. So now we're further going to deplete our nursing uh, and our ability to care for these patients. The board plans to meet and consider these rules October 13th. Espino says before a final decision is made, she hopes the board will listen to those like her who are against the vaccine requirement. Coming together and really talking about the risks and what are the real risks. Um, maybe doing studies of the risks and is the risk of being a nurse in a hospital any different than these patients or these other staff in the hospitals getting the disease. We did reach out to the Oregon Nurses Association for comment, but they told us that they would not be participating at this time. We also reached out to the board, but have not yet heard back. Live in Northwest Portland, Bridget Chavez, Fox 12 Oregon.